So here we are for another Heads Up Racer tech tip and it has to do with the Race Pack VNet system. VNet basically is vehicle network. It uses a CAN bus which is proprietary to uh, Race Pack and there are some things that you really should not do. And we're going to talk about a few of them today. So I've got this Race Pack Sportsman and plugged into it, I have a VNet module. Now, this is not a good idea. Even if you have the space to do this at the, with this mounted in your car, don't do this because you have the weight hanging off of this connector. If your car has a lot of tire shake, this will move around. And there is, inside of the connector, on the one side you will see the male pins, and on the other side you will see the female pins now, or female socket, sorry. So, in here, you can actually see little brass pieces. Those pieces, if you get a lot of tire shake, can get dislodged. If they fall out and they will go out onto the pin and it'll slide out on the pin, you're no longer having a tight contact with the connecting surface. So that could mean that you could lose data, you could lose power, stuff like that. Now we talked about not hanging one of the modules like this. You always should use either a six inch cable, that's just a direct cable, there's minimal weight, you don't ever want to damage this, these connections with tire shake because you've got to send the whole thing back. So one of the other things that happens that I've seen quite often and I've had to tell people it's not a good idea is on the firewall connector, this fella, they will hang a bunch of these and stack them off and drop off to their devices. That's even worse because you've got all of this weight that's doing this and they also have done it on the inside as well. So if you get these pins, the connections breaking down in here, you lose everything downstream from where the connection breaks. So always go with a straight cable. So if you can come with a six inch cable, if you've got modules inside and the same on the outside, then go and stack these together. And there are uh, brackets that are available online for you to go and hold them together. Or you can tie wrap the strip of them tie wrap them together this way and then tie wrap it to uh, brake lines or something that are running along the firewall but don't ever stack them so that's our tech tip it helps uh, keep your v-net uh, solid and reliable and you know that the one time you need to get that data and it fails you won't be happy. So that's our tech tip for today.